Today I'm going to show you how to edit a web page in Joomla. So to start off, if we go to your website, this is my test area I've set up here, and we go to forward slash administrator, and then you log in with your details. Right, now what we want to do, if I open this up in a new tab, so let's say we want to change this shoes page that I created here. Um, what we want to do is we want to look and find its menu item. So if we go to menus, main menu, now you might have a few menus in here and you might have to look for a few different ones. Um, but this is a fairly simple website, so I've only got one here. So I'm just going to go ahead and select this. And then straight away I can see right here that I've got the shoes page that I would, was wanting to edit. Um, if you have a lot of menu items in here, it can be quite difficult to sort through. And so you've actually got this search feature up here, which can narrow it down. So if I was to put in here shoes, you see it only brings me back that one. So that can be really helpful on larger websites. So if we go ahead, click into this shoes menu item, we now have all of the details about that menu item here. But the thing we want to edit is the article, because all of the contents of this page, which is just this on this example website, are actually stored in the article that is um, the menu item is set to. So if we come over here and click on edit article, it opens up this pop-up box and now we actually are able to edit everything that is inside of the article. So all of this stuff here. Um, so if I just show, for example, like that, and then I click save and close, that's literally all I need to do to then get more content on there. So that's how you make a simple edit to a Joomla web page. There's obviously more advanced things you can do in here through this WYSIWYG area. You could select this content and then click on this here, this little paper clip to turn this into a link. So if we wanted to link this to another page, for example, we could just go ahead and grab the URL here and then copy that and then paste that in. Click on OK. And now we have this when I save and close and we go back to the shoes page, you can see I can click on that and it takes me to that featured articles page. So that's really all there is to it. There's also other options. You could add images in through here, through uh, this one. And there's a variety of other features, but ultimately, you know, it should be fairly straightforward. So if you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a like and I'll see you in the next video.